Titans are seven and five. The Oakland Raiders are six and six. 325 start time in Oakland this Sunday. Time now for Mike Vrabel's keys to success. Let's begin on third and fourth down for the Raiders. Got to stop them on those third and fourth downs. We do. We have to get back. This team is, uh, you know, they're in the top ten in the NFL. They're, they're seventh and third and fourth down. They don't commit a lot of penalties offensively. So therefore, just like with the Colts, we said they have a lot of third and manageable down in distances, third and four, third and three. And, you know, they're around 45, 46 percent. So they do a nice job there. It'll be a huge challenge for us defensively. All right. Second key is score touchdowns in the red zone, something the Titans have done well this year. We have. We have to continue uh, with that confidence. We have to get our players to understand how critical it is to, to be able to get down there know what they're doing some teams identities change a little bit coverages change they uh, is this a pressure team is this a zone team you know it'll be critical that they understand that that we get them to understand that and how we're going to try to attack them and and be able to score touchdowns all right now the last one our punt versus their punt i don't understand what that means yeah we have to be able to win this field position okay. and and they are averaging um you know 11 and a half yards of return and it's critical that that we're able to to punt the football go down there and cover it and not lose you talked about hidden yardage and we always talk about that when we give them the ball and they give it to us back how much yardage is gained or lost on field position and so um you know we feel that's going to be critical and keep the penalties low too just three for 33 at indianapolis that, that would that's be nice. right in mike vrabel's wheelhouse yeah we're trending down eight six and three the last three games and um that that can be a huge key for us if if we're able to to play disciplined uh out in oakland in terms of travel to the west coast how difficult do you really think it is coming from the central time zone i i, I mean i it doesn't we're going to leave whenever we need to get there at 4 30 like we always do uh, on saturday and um you know we'll, we'll we'll set our alarms when when they say that we need to get up and we'll go play the football game so you don't feel like doing anything special for west coast travel is worthwhile um no i mean i don't really i think that the best thing to do is is to to prepare um to understand the opponent to know the player that we're going against what's his skill set how's he like to play is he fast? Is he long? Is he is he a powerful player? Who's covering me? Uh, those are the things that are critical. Not uh, n you know not what time it is or the daylight savings or you know anything like that. You just really stick to football. I try. It's boring, but I like no, it. No, I don't want to say it's boring, but I mean some people like to take through every detail. And you just don't feel like that's necessary. Maybe that's a waste of time. No, it's not a waste of time. I think that there are certain things, you know, we'll have a little longer flight and then they'll feed us well and, you know, we'll have to stay hydrated, but, you know, we'll, we'll be ready to go and, and hopefully uh, prepared. And hopefully come back eight and five. Okay. That works. That'll work. All right. The Titans going to take on the Oakland Raiders. Again, the Titans are seven and five. The Raiders are six and six battling for a playoff spot. Kickoff is set for 325 Central Time. Titans Radio. What time is that Pacific time? 135. Gotcha. 125. 125. The, you've thrown me. The game is on the air here on Titans Radio at 230 Central. For Mike Vrabel, who got me. I'm Mike Keith. Thanks for joining us.